family that eats together stays together. One chilly winter evening, Ria, Ricky, and the parents decided to stay home and snuggle near the warm bonfire. While mommy was reading a book, Ricky and Papa were building a house of cards. And little Ria munched on some popcorns whilst watching her favorite cartoon. When Ria watched cartoons, she was too absorbed to even hear her mommy. Come on, Ria, it's time for dinner, called out Ria's mom. Ria was wrapped in her world of cartoons and did not pay heed to her mother's incessant calling. <laughs> so funny, Ria chuckled and laughed. Mommy walked over to Ria, grabbed her tablet, and switched it off. Ria, enough of watching TV. Come on, let's have dinner, ordered her mommy. Ria, who was clearly enjoying her show, frowned and followed mommy. Ria and her family gathered at the dinner table. However, Ria was still upset and pretended to not eat her dinner. What's the matter, Ria? Why are you not eating? inquired Papa. Papa, I want to watch my TV show. Why can't I eat and watch my show at the same time? asked Ria. Because dinner time is family time. You can always watch your show later, said Ria's father. But I want to eat and watch my favorite show, just like we munch popcorns and watch movies, complained Ria. Papa looked over at Mommy and smiled. He then grabbed her plate and placed it in her room. Here is your tablet, Ria. There, we have placed your food in your room. You can watch your show while eating there, said Papa. Ria jumped with joy and grabbed the tablet. She rushed to her room where her father had placed her bowl of food, neatly on her study table. Ria chuckled and munched on food. She was having too much fun to notice what she had done. The next day, Ria's food was neatly placed on her study table with her tablet again. Ria could hardly believe her luck. She munched on her creamy pasta and continued watching her favorite TV show. This went on for a few days, and soon, Ria was always eating alone in her room, watching her favorite show. But then, Ria started to miss her family time. When Ria was free, Ricky was busy doing homework. Her parents were busy doing home chores, too. One day, she heard Ricky and her parents chuckle and laugh and enjoy some noodles at the dinner table. Ria shut her favorite show and peeped out of her room. Everyone seemed to be enjoying themselves on the dinner table. Ria felt left out and rushed to join her family at the dinner table. Mommy, Daddy, can I sit here at the dinner table? Asked Ria. But what about your favorite show? Teased her father. I can always watch it later, said Ria. Coyly, she went up to her mother, hugged her. I'm sorry, Mommy. I did not listen to you before, apologized Ria. It is okay, Ria. It is not bad to watch your favorite TV show. But dinner time is the only time the family comes together. So we must eat together, explained Mommy. And that is how Ria learned to value her dinner time with her family.